Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are doing this month's empties. As you can see, there is quite more, like quite a lot more stuff than I had last month. So without further delay, let's just go and get started. So the first thing that I used up is this uh, Cyan Chain, I still don't know how to pronounce the Cellar Beauty Serum that I got in Lil. This was actually a really really nice serum. It was heavy it, it is heavily scented but I didn't actually notice it um, breaking me out so that was fine. As you can see there's literally so little left that I honestly can't even scoop it out. It's really like difficult you know. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put it in the bin. Uh, this was about four euros in a little really liked it um, not keen on the scent but if they bring out uh, another serum with you know little less scented then I would definitely buy it again and the next thing I used up is the um, Emma Hardy Moringa cleansing balm so this is what it looks like zero nothing left this again is heavily scented I don't know what's going on with these companies just putting so much like perfume into their products um i honestly really really liked it um i am actually considering when i finish my uh, cleansing gel to go ahead and buy a cleansing balm instead because it was so easy to remove my makeup plus it actually you know hydrated my skin as well so which like the gels don't do they actually dry your skin a little bit so um this was a plus i received it in one of my look fantastic boxes which i'm going to link up here um uh, but yeah really good i will check out the price because uh, since it was in look fantastic i can imagine uh it's not cheap but yeah i'll check out the price and if not i will find another alternative because i really like the cleansing balms and the next thing I used up is the Monu Skin Rose Oil, Rose Facial Oil, I think that's what it's called. This is actually not the package for it, uh, I just uh, filled it, it, I just filled that oil into this container because the other one that came in was without a droplet or, you know, some sort of an applicator or something. So I just said, I'll just put it into that. Um, I liked it, uh, but it like it's, I know it's an oil, but it was really, really oily. Um, I don't think I would go out of my way to get it. However, if I ever receive it again in one of my boxes, I would definitely, uh, you know, use it up again because it was good. Um, great for dry skin, but actually, I uh, can't believe I'm saying this, but it was a bit too oily for me. I know. Oh, I know what's going on. Uh, so I think that is it for skincare. The next thing I'm actually throwing out because I did not like it. And this is the Sunkiss Self Tan Mousse. Um, this is in the shade medium. When you actually pump it out, it comes out green. Which is kind of weird in my opinion. Um, like... Whenever I put it on, it looked amazing. Like right after the application or let's say six hour, hours after the application. But when I go in to wash off the excess, like not only the excess comes off, but the actual tanner comes off as well. So it does not last. That's what I'm gonna say. Like maybe if you wanna have a nice tan for a day, then yeah sure maybe it was really cheap like four euro or so but i'm just throwing that up because i don't like it i don't like if i'm applying tan i want it to last for at least three to four days you know not a day you know uh, so this is going to the bin and the next thing i used up is the oh shoot here we go is the lacura moisture conditioner uh, from Aldi. I actually used up the shampoo the other day as well, but I can't remember where I put that container, so 
Oh, sorry. It literally looks the same, just a, just a white label. Um, but you know, these look like a knockoff Aussie um, hair products, which, you know, I'm actually not mad at. Aussie is quite expensive for, you know, for what it is, a shampoo and a conditioner. Uh, so when I saw this in Aldi, I said, I'll pick it up, I'll give it a try. And I do not regret this. I think this is the range that I've been using on my hair for, I'd say a couple of months now at least. And I'm very happy with the results. My hair, you know, like they're blonde, so they're not gonna be super shiny, but they are. So um, I'm quite happy with that. Definitely gonna repurchase it. And I know Little has the same range. So keep an eye on that. Oh, the last thing. So it's not that long. I thought I had more things to actually talk to you about. Uh, anyway, the last thing I used up is the Eveline Cosmetics. What is that? Okay, so it's a two in one, a balm and a scrub for under like using under the shower so this is what it looks like everything is here in polish so you know um this is like one of those scrubs that once you apply it to the skin and it comes in contact with the skin it actually cools your um you know your legs and wherever you put it uh because this one has some um, you know anti-cellulite properties which i don't think are true anyway i just bought it for um for being you know like a like a body lotion plus a scrub in one which is you know it's taken away from my daily routine i don't i didn't have to moisturize uh when i was using this uh but now i do and i don't think i can find it anywhere i don't know did i i think i bought it i must have bought it in poland uh when i was over there so whenever i'm back uh i would probably buy this or something similar uh from this um uh, brand because it's very known for these kind of uh products so uh so yeah that's it that's it for my empties Thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Um, so yeah, thank you. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.